Come on in. <laughs> I'll tell you something. Chabba! Nothing guys, how you doing? Back on the road again. Whoa, and today, me and cameraman, we're in Leeds and I'm thinking, do you know what? I need to try something that's going to get me going, that's going to get me singing. I'm thinking, where can I go? Chef Shabba! There's a place. Right, in Ed Edinley, right in Shieldentville. All right, pal, as you can see there, look. He's had a bit of a thumbs up, think, what was it? Oh, you, how you doing? All right, there's a place up here called Chef Shabba. I think it's Chef Shabba's Kitchen, right? And uh, apparently the food in here is absolutely amazing. All students are loving it. Shabba! All right, we've pulled up just up road and, and we're already being mobbed here, cameraman, aren't we? So let's get in. It's round here somewhere. All right, these students says, get up there, get yourself a good fill. So come on, Shabba, let's go. Oh, we are here. Uh, we, I absolutely love it in, in Edinley, in Leeds, around here, because full places just pop up all the time. All right, there's little narrow roads. You can't park anywhere for loving the money. All right. And the students are just crazy, aren't they, cameraman? They come at you from every angle. As soon as they know you're here, bang, they're out. Oh, so we've got to be around here somewhere. Now, up here, what's that? Is that a takeaway? Oh no, it's student lettings. Let's let this guy through. All right, oh, we've done we've done an HFC. We've done one of them. Uh, I think that was it, uh, Beeston. It's old Beeston. But up here as well, I remember this because this is one of the uh, first ones that we did up here. LS, LS, uh, LS6 Dutch Fries. That one, all right. Right, so. We are coming up, Joe Sat Nav says you're nearly here. Can I get here? Is this it here? Oh yes. Oh, I can't oh I can park here, look. I'm getting here. Yes. Shabba. <laughs> it is called Shabba. What's all this? Pallets. Look like loads of pallets. Ding 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 ding. Loads of I love this. I've seen this before. I think we did a like a um, but it, well, Mexican on Main Road, and they had all coloured palettes. It's just a way of using a minute, making it all look good. Right, there we go. So we're parked up. Now, like I said, full of students. So, what do students want? They want nice, cheap food. So, let's see if this place is delivering what everybody's saying nice, cheap, affordable food, great taste, good for money. Let's go for it, cameraman. It's time to eat, time to move your feet. Hey, oh, whoa, here we go, cameraman. Look, I've got me here. Uh, anybody remembers these from back in the day? Got me uh, my waterproof Jordans out. Right, oh, oh, let's go. Oh, be, be careful, we're going to get knocked over here. Right, put my phone in my pocket. I'm not organised today, cameraman. It's because I'm giddy. It's because I shabba, shabba. I think I want to dance. Right, be careful at the table and chair. I don't want it falling out and smacking me in the face. Here we go, cracker. <laughs> Oh, what about that cameraman? Yeah, we got up, we got up and down to Scotland, didn't we? Like lightning. I wonder, I wonder if anybody else can get up and down as fast as us in our super van. No, they cannot. <laughs> right, let's hope weather holds up as well. Right, let's go for it. Time to go. <laughs> right, here we go. Look at this place here. So this is. Chef Shabba's Kitchen, all right, you've been telling me to come down and try it out. All these colourful palettes here, look at this, eh? this is how you use stuff this, eh? let's get it sorted out. Looks like there's a bit of a cover as well, cameraman, so we're not going to get covered in rain. Right, come on, let's go in and let's see what's going on. Shabba! Oh, hey, look, cameraman, it's like well, it's a Love Island here with all this old world. Eh, look at this, eh? do a bit of a pause if you want. <laughs> right, come on. Whoa, hey up. Hiya mate, you alright? Who are you up? How you doing? Are you Chef Shabba? I am indeed. Very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. Right, so I've heard great things yeah. about your big Shabba Caribbean box. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes. Is it good? It is amazing. Yeah. So, so what's in that? Uh, the jerk one yeah. has got seasoned fries, got rice and peas, mac and cheese, also got tender stem broccoli, and it's got jerk chicken, jerk wings, mm. and also lamb chops. Oh. And how can I forget jerk prawns as well? Jerk prawns, now yeah. we're talking. So I want one of them please, mate. Would you like one of them? Yeah, and then yeah. can I get a bottle of water as well? 
Of course. Yep. We have the good old Yorkshire water. That'll do for me, mate. Yeah. Good old Yorkshire water. Let's have some yeah. of that. And that will be uh, 25, £25. I'm just watching what we're, what we're making up here. What's this? Oh. This is the Vicks uh, Cafe, is it? All right. It's not for me, though, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I'll pay on car, please, no, mate, for that. That's for me. Is that for you? Yeah. You're going to have that before you cook my dinner? Yeah. Thank you. Perfect, that's gone through. There you go. Look at that, right? We'll have one of them and all. I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> right, I look forward to this. Thank you. Yeah. Right, come on, cameraman. Let's go get sorted. Here we go, cameraman. Stepping out of Love Island, here. <laughs> right, oh. You know what? Look at this. I got it today. And I thought, oh no, it's banging it down. But look at this, we've got one of these roofs, like plastic sheets. It's gonna keep me a little bit dry, in it? Right, where are we going, cameraman? Here, up here, go up here. Out of the way, and then people can get in and out. Bosh, there you go, how's that? Get it, we've got it. What he's saying to me, right, we had this conversation, he says, Dan, we've got to get angles right. He says, what do you mean? He says, your chins keep hanging off. <laughs> no, I didn't. Right, put knacker cracker away. I'm talking gibberish. Oh, oh, chair test, bang. I won't mind if it went here, actually, because we could sit on these. Cushions, look. Ooh. Oh, I need some heat, don't we? Hey, I like sign. That's a great shabber. <laughs> what song was that off? Is it a song or is it just what like a DJ said? Did he just keep saying, shabber? So yeah, when, when you're up Walsers, remember back in the day you'd be up Walser and it'd be like, uh, here we go next song, one, two, three, everybody get on, get on, get on, shabba! Woo! And then they flip you off, don't they? <laughs> Swing out, and off you go, woo! <laughs> I used to throw up me, and because I was, because I'm so big, if I started to slide, I used to go smash anybody that were outside of me used to have the ribs cracked, let me tell you. <laughs> so we've come here, it's this big box, so I remember going over to Manchester and having uh, what it trap kitchen and having like their box and they've got like main course and dessert and then all the uh, Jamaican restaurants Caribbean restaurants takeaways and that now they're starting to do these boxes and now this is the jerk box all right it's supposed to be absolutely spot on let's go oh cameraman uh, my, my, my fingers are getting a bit nimble now it's that time of year where it's freezing to death and I'm thinking fingerless gloves yeah, I think I've had some before, but I look like uh, it reminded me of that bird woman out of Home Alone. <laughs> you know what I mean? I want to get covered in bird poo, throwing, throwing bird seed with fingerless gloves, feed the birds. That, that's Mary Poppins, isn't it? Tup and bag. Oh, pull me, oh, 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 pull my leg. Put muscle in my leg. I've started swimming, you know. I'll tell you something. I reckon I'm going to be an Olympic swimming by the end of the year. <laughs> Eh, never mind butterfly stroke. It's like the here comes the whale. Boom! I'm like Jaws. I'm like a fried chip. Talking, talking rubbish again. Ah, nah, talking rubbish. Just trying to keep myself warm, keep myself active. But, but better be careful because if I start jumping about, chair's gonna go. And I know some of you were a bit disappointed that when me and Cameron were up at Scotland, that I didn't get table and chair out because it was somewhat like this, wasn't it? But so today I brought it. I thought you know we've got to keep. It's old table and chair, but it went in for MOT. That's what it did. It went in for MOT. It had, it had all its joint spread. Uh, <laughs> bit of oil on. See, chair's been reinforced so that I don't fall through it. Bush. It's, it's, it's lasting well, this, you know, this chair. I'm, I'm, I'm all right jinxing it now, but. It is. So, <clears throat> across the board, all these houses here, a lot of them, right, in this area, uh, 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 are full of students and there'll be like six or seven rooms in there all to let and you, you want to come up and down here every Friday night when they're all out partying it's absolutely mental so I, I can I can expect if this place is any good I can expect this being rammed people inside outside takeaways taking it all home it'll be absolutely crazy <laughs> getting to that time of day now <laughs> where it's like car wars up and down here 
because there's cars parked either side of the road. I'll tell you something, there must be a mini club along here. And just look, I've never seen so many minis in my life. One, two, three, there's four of them. Four, four minis parked outside at the road here. You're lucky if you see one. It must be the car of choice. Fox Shilden, so let's get minis. Easy to park up in Edinburgh. But yeah, it's like car wars because they're all parked at both sides of the road. Somebody asked me a question the other day. They said about like like this top. This is one of my original merch pieces. The very first one that we had. And they were asking me about the now then. And obviously the, the or is the Yorkshire Rose. And then asking why I got a three there. Backwards three. And it, you know, it, me, cameraman, editor. One, two, three. One, two, three. And you know, we're all a bit daft. So backwards three, now then. <laughs> Back up road again. Oh, doors opening, cameraman, what we got? What we got? Here we are. <laughs> this is it, this is it. Thank you very much. Wow. Look, even opens box, look at that. Wow, that looks amazing, that. Not too bothered about devil's food. But that smells, that smells nice. That smells absolutely fantastic. So, Chef Shabba, I'm just gonna shut it back up when he's done this and have a quick conversation before I tuck in. Because I want to know how it's all come about. Because I've been up and down this road a few times and yeah. then people have recommended you. So, what's your story? Well, I came from Manchester two years ago, just a, just in the middle of lockdown, the second yeah. lockdown. Right. Yeah, for a job opportunity, opening a restaurant in Leeds. So, yeah. came up. I think when the restaurant got up and running, they decided that they didn't need my skill anymore, so All they right. hire uh, someone younger, probably could pay less. All right, and yeah. Then got rid of me, so I thought I like it here in the, in Leeds in Yorkshire, so and the people quite yeah. take on to me as well. So didn't have much, enough money, so I started to a takeaway. So start cooking and doing a little bit of takeaway. People gravitate to that. That got really exactly. Was well, that from your home? Uh, no, it was it was from a ghost kitchen. They All right, the yeah, yeah. Food stars, yeah. A ghost kitchen. So, you know, I bought my own cooker, brought it in there, and uh, as soon as we got busy again, then it seemed like the rent was just fluctuating, getting yeah, higher and yeah, higher. Yeah. So someone told me about a place in Hyde Park and said, you know what, you might want to look at it. It's going. So when I seen it, I thought, hmm, I could do right, something with this. You know, and of course, you know. So, who, whose idea were all this then? Because I love it. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't so much of an idea. It was about budget. Budget. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have much money, so I thought a pallet is three pound. You know, and then I, you know, with a hut, I've always wanted. Yeah. It's a dream come true to have a Caribbean restaurant yeah, in yeah. the UK. Yeah, so, yeah. And I wanted to make it feel more like. Because it's like a tiki bar in there. When I yeah. first walked in, it was like walking into uh, Love Island with, with leaves on wall and all that greenage. Oh. Then you walk into a tiki bar, but out here, I, I personally, I just thought, hey, you've smashed it here because with it, with the area being full of students, it gives it that like student sort of feel as you're coming. But then when you walk through the door, you get like a totally different vibe. Then you're like walking into it like a restaurant, and then you've got tiki bar. It's all going on. Oh, thank you. So, man. well, I'm going to crack on with this, chef. In fact, it's all right. Crack on it smells lovely. Know. Oh, I've got an iPhone 4 here, looks so I don't get it dirty. <laughs> right, I'll uh, I'll see you soon, Thank mate. You Thank you. Let's have a look at this. So we've got little Chef Shabbard on there. Reminds me of South Park. <laughs> you know how, how logo is. Are you ready? Look at that. Steam's coming off. Oh, my God. So it looks like we've got a bit of sauce, mac and cheese, some shrimp, some fries, some jerk, jerk chops, jerk chicken, rice, bit of broccoli. What's that? That can go, cameraman. I'm getting rid of this here. Oh, I don't even want to get it with my fork here. Oh, 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 cameraman. Get rid of that. Get rid of that devil's food. Get, get it then. You can have that. Go on, good lad. Oh, let's get that off here. God. I know some of you are going to be going, oh, come on, what's it with devil's food? It ain't good. I don't like, is it good, cameraman? Oh, he's munching into that guy. He's straight in. He's like, yeah, it's cold. I'm having it. Right. So let's start off. We've got some rice and peas here. These look sauced up. These look like they are saucy as. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Go on then, put it down. <laughs> wow. I ain't kidding you. That, it's got a bit of sauce on. Oh, that is amazing. That jerk sauce, 
on top of that rice and peas. Oh my God. So we've got a couple of bits of tender stem broccoli. Now this guys has cost 25 quid. Wow. Broccoli, nice bit of crunch to it. What is this then? Ah, it's like a little tub of coleslaw, I think. Whoa, don't want that neither. That was sniper in me. Look at that. When have you ever seen that in your life? When have you ever seen that? Who, who put sweet corn in coleslaw? Eh, come on, Shabba. Sort yourself out, lad. Who put sweet corn in coleslaw? I bet he's done that on purpose. <laughs> right, planting. So I, I used to think it were big pieces of banana back in there when I was a kid. Oh, yes. And it's nice, I know. And it's like a, the taste of the, of the planting. It's a bit like a, 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 a tea. <laughs> like a fried chip. But then it's got a bit of a sweetness to it. Right, let's see what this is. Ah, chicken. Bit of jerk chicken. So it looks like a chicken thigh. Let's get this skin off here. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Gum. Oh, guys. Wow. Oh my god. Let's taste the chicken wing. So this jerk chicken. Oh, I'll tell you something. That restaurant that's let him go. What fools you are. <laughs> that is amazing. So you've got two chicken wings, chicken leg and a chicken thigh. Let's get to the chips. So you've got some chips in here with a bit of sauce on. And again, it's covered in a jerk seasoning bit looks. The, the, the jerk sauce is absolutely bang on. My, my tongue is tingling. Wow. Now, oh my God. Nice soft chips. But the jerk sauce has got a nice bit of heat to it. Giving a nice tingle to my tongue and my lips on a day like this. Oh, oh, oh. We've got some sriracha mayo, I think, here as well. On the chips. That has that little bit more flavour. I know sometimes people go, oh, 25 quid. Oh, oh, spilling water on myself. What you've got to think about with this? I'm dribbling water down my chins. What you've got to think is you've got a lot of individual dishes on here to sample in this box. I'm going to leave the chops to the last because they look amazing. So we have got here mac and cheese. Oh, look at that. Pulls it. I'm going to do that again. Watch this cameraman. Oh, so it's like cheese on top. You've got all that mac and cheese in there. Look, spices. Right, it's all in there. You've got the jerk, jerk seasoning on top. I can't wait to try this. Uh, jerk mac and cheese. Oh. oh, wow. Oh, oh my God. I'm going to have another piece of this camera, man, because do you know why? I'm going to be, I'm going to be greedy because it's that good. Oh, right. Then you've got your shrimp. Let's go. Smells good. This is in a, in a different sauce. Wow. Oh my God. If I'm honest with you, I'm not usually into the shrimp done like that. But that sauce, it's got a tang, I'm going to put it with chips, it's got a tangy sweetness to it. Push it, come mate. Yeah, Come on in. Right, How are you finding it? Is it good? This, have you been here? Yeah, yeah, it's decent, isn't it? It's banging this, mate. Yeah. Isn't it? Big plate of food, though, isn't it? So, so I'm trying to get over to people. It's 25 quid, but I think it's valuable for money. Do you think? No, it's quite a lot of like carbs and stuff, though. It's quite cheap to make. Well, you've but got the, you've nice. got the meat, the chops. You've got the you've got the shrimp on there as well. How's the shrimp? I've never had that before. Do you want one? Oh, mate, come on. I'll, you, you paid all this for that. Get one. Is he going to let me have it? Yeah, get one, mate, get all one. Right, Just try one, because I think they're beautiful. Straight in, I'll have another one with you. Gorgeous. What were we thinking, then? One word to describe that. Evan. Flawless. Yeah, flawless. Good, isn't it? That's good, that, mate. You want, grab a picture, you mate. Of course you can. Bosh. Oh, right, pal. Back, Bosh. Mate. Bosh. Bosh. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> see you later, pal. Right. Oh, see the probs are gone now. They're out of town. Right, look at these chops. So I know what you're saying with the carbs, but for me, the ingredients, what you've got to make this, that's what you've got to think about. 
All right, this is good. Look at this. Oh, wow. Guys, oh my, I'm finishing this off. Now, oh, come on. <laughs> Bit of bum. Now, as you know, I used to work at Butchers. That is quality. That is quality meat, that. Quality lamb chop. Again, with the jerk sauce on there. Absolutely gorgeous. This whole thing is just bursting with flavour. You've got the rice and peas. Let's go through it. Rice and peas. Beautiful, soft, fluffy rice. Got that nice coconutty taste to it. It will finish off with a bit of sauce on. The sauce has gone now. I think the sauce was from the jerk chicken, but... Oh... The planting, absolutely gorgeous. Cooked well. I love it, mate. Like I said, I used to think it were bananas. I now know that it's not. The big lump of devil's food. Caravan's had that. Then I got spiked with this stuff. Whoever put sweet corn in coleslaw, I'm going to have to speak to Shabba about this because that's not on. <laughs> that, that is not something that you do, Shabba. <laughs> then we moved on. We've got the broccoli. Tender stem broccoli. Absolutely gorgeous cooks well I think that's just a nice bit of greenage to the meal gives it a bit of freshness the jerk chicken you've got the thigh excuse me guys couple of wings and a leg again cooked brilliant nice and succulent chicken with that jerk seasoning that jerk flavor tingling on my lips still tingling up back of my throat then I moved on to the chips covered in the jerk sauce then you've got a bit of uh, like a peri peri mayonnaise on there look at them just beautiful beautiful little Skin on. Oh. Mac and cheese. I keep saying this. It's not my thing. It's slowly becoming my thing. When it's jazzed up like this with a bit of jerk in it, full of a, a crusty cheese top. <laughs> Who don't like a crusty cheese top? I know I do. Beautiful, gorgeous, full of flavour. Then we went on to prawns. I can't show you at prawns because I ate three of them and my mate took one. But that sauce, got a beautiful sweetness to it. They were soft, they were tender, they tasted great. Finished it off with these beautiful lamb chops. Look at that, loads of sauce on there. Nice bit of meat, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. Cooked really, really well. For me, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. All right. I'd pay 25 quid for that. I think it's worth it for the amount of little different bits of food that you get. I think, you know, on this style of food, with the rice and peas, the mac and cheese and, and the meat, this is probably one of the best I've had, to be fair. Looks great. It tastes great. So, if you've been down here, all right, to Chef Shabba's Kitchen, let me know what you think. If you've not been, come down, try it out, and please drop it in comments, because if you like Caribbean, wow, uh, what a fool you are for letting this guy go. For me, guys, it's a nice solid 10. I'm cracking on with this lamb chop and I'm decking that mac and cheese. I'll see you next time. Oh, it just pulls straight off. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah of course you can, love. Of course you can. Oh, thank you. No, I'm about to do a review, yeah. 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 Oh. oh, well, there you go. Come on in. <laughs> Thank you. There you go. Thank you very much Cheers, for watching, love. Right. Yeah? How are you doing? Not too bad. This is a new place, isn't it? You I'm can come in, bad. mate. You don't have to shy away. <laughs> Get in out of the way. We've been playing hockey, have you? Well, no, I'm on my way to a game. Are you? Yeah, bloody yeah, hell. I'm I, watching all your videos. They're bagging. Yeah, I used to play that when I was at school, but I used to get told off because I just kept whacking it on the floor and I could never hit out. <laughs> hey, if you can't watch any of us play, you're pretty oh, much doing the same thing. Yeah. Do you mind if I got a photo? No, not at all, mate, not at all. Do you want a selfie? Do you want me to take it for you? Yeah, that's all right. Thank all right, you. nice to meet you, mate. Nice to meet you all too, right, man. pal. Cheers. See you later, pal. Yeah, and best of luck. Smash him! <laughs> what, what are you up to today? Uh, I've lost it now, I'll get an air cut. There you go. Is there. a video in it? Yeah, is that all right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Give a wave. <laughs> That's my cameraman. All right. That's it. Yeah, of course you can. All right, mate. Thank you very much, Paul. Thank you. Nice to meet you. See you later.